Hey guys, you're back here again with Barry, and uh, I'm just feeling, uh, killing a Sunday afternoon with a good buddy of mine, Cole, who's heading back to Canada, and uh, want to spend as much time as we can together. Anyway, I want to keep you posted on uh, changes again in the region, which I know I've done a lot of videos about that, because the region is changing. I, I want to emphasize how important this is for folks that are already here or looking at investing here or contemplating coming down for a visit. Um, I'm in an area that's just below Loma Alta and it's called Los Valles and they're doing uh, the caliche right now. Uh, John and I were saying, uh, oh, I guess almost about a year ago now, uh, that they're going to be caliching and then asphalting this road and it's coming to fruition again just like the other roads were. Um, some of the subscribers that stay tuned to the channel for the what's going on, what's happening around Cabrera will recognize this. Uh, we've sold several uh, parcels of land here. Uh, just, oh my god, uh, names like Joshua come into effect and uh, my God, uh, Sherry, uh, Hunter, those kind of great folks. Well, as we said years ago, because most of them bought about, I'd say, anywhere from two to four years ago, uh, lo and behold, you'll probably be interested in this video because this is all running by your property lines. And, uh, oh, they're saying uh, about a month and a half this thing's going to all be asphalted. So... When it comes to fruition, like I do on the other ones, I just finished one with John uh, from uh, Abreu to uh, Rio San Juan. Uh, I'll be doing the same thing with this one. I will fill you in when the asphalting comes into place. Uh, this is actually, it's a wonderful thing to see if you live here. And uh, progress is good. The people here have all chipped in to make this happen. Some of our partners have chipped in. Uh, Joshua would recognize this if he ever watches the film because we just passed by the front of his place. But anyway, all of this stuff that I'm driving over right now uh, in about a month and a half should be black topped. And we'll continue this a little further, but in about a um, quarter mile from now, what I'm gonna be doing is I'm gonna be meeting up with the Loma Alta Road, and uh, so Los Valles runs parallel Loma Alta, only it's a little bit lower. Uh, just this is my personal two cents. It's not anything uh, to take to the bank, but uh, I don't think it will ever develop to the status of the high end that Loma Alta would, and obviously is taking into effect now. But my gosh, is this going to open up doors already? Uh, property should sell for a little bit more than it was prior to this because now everybody who lives here has caught wind to what's happening. And uh, all you good folks that did buy years ago, I hope you're going to enjoy this because I know you've really uh, appreciated in value, which rightfully so. Uh, I just missed this tree on the camera. So I'm going to round the corner here. I kind of jumped up the gear a little bit more just so you'll see where we're going. Uh, I don't want to stretch this into a long video. But right around this bend here, there's this bend right down this hill is going to meet up with Loma Alta. And you can see a car in the foreground that's coming from the paved road at Loma Alta. So once I'm at the top of this hill, I'll cut it off and keeping you in the loop about what's happening around Cabrera. This is Barry and there's Loma Alta right there where the uh, motorcycle's coming in. And we'll talk to you soon on future videos, okay? Looking forward to all the people coming down this next month. It's going to be a busy one. Looking forward to seeing y'all. Okay, talk to you soon. Bye.